Welcome in everyone, welcome in. Another day, another day. Hopefully you guys liked the last video. If you haven't gone to see that, go check it out. I got some new pew pews. That was a good video. So today, it's uh, snowing. Well, it did snow overnight. We got the diesel heater running and uh, we are about to go ship some stuff at FedEx. Well, somebody bought, you guys are really fucking close, aren't you? Somebody bought some forks so some Suron forks. If you guys don't know what a Suron is, I have a Suron. So we'll ride some of that during the summer. But uh, it's like an electric dirt bike. Uh, they're pretty popular last year and now. But so somebody bought some of my Suron forks that I like switched out, and then uh, then we gotta go get a massage. So every Monday I get usually a massage. So we're just getting ready. Nice and 68 degrees inside a house. I watched a movie last night. And uh, that was awesome. Had some popcorn. Popcorn. Where I was was only 99 cents. Homemade popcorn. What? You don't see that anymore. 99 cents. It was nice and buttery, too. It was actually some really good popcorn. You guys like popcorn? Let me know in the comments below if you like popcorn. So we're going to get our vitamins in us. I uh, got a new little setup here to get some water going on. So all I got to do is... Grab my vitamins or whatever I want to. Oh yeah, and I got a flask. So I got like a new flask instead of a big old water bottle. I've had this like water bottle that was like stainless steel for the longest time and it was like, I don't know. It wasn't working for some reason. It was just, you have to really clean those stainless steel cups or anything or it's just gonna, the, the water or anything is gonna start tasting very, very weird. So I threw it away with that and I just went with a, uh, Regular plastic. But yeah, today I gotta ship some stuff, go get a massage, and then what else do I gotta get going on? Maybe later on we're gonna cut some wood. But I gotta do some things on the computer. I gotta email a couple people. What else do I gotta do? Oh, I really wanna finish up that course for the ham radio so we can get that going on this week. Go take the test type of thing. So that way we can keep moving forward with that. But uh, just another relaxing day, really, sorta. Phoenix is uh, jumping up on his little uh, stool up there. So, I think the last video, you guys, I told you guys about my uh, diesel heater, the um, trickle charger not being big enough. Well, I got a new one coming, but I got also have an old one that I've been using that's been working fine. So, yep, just another chill day. I might see what I can do. Maybe take you guys on a range. I don't think uh, the range that I'm wanting to go to because it's cold out I'm not gonna shoot outside won't allow shotguns but plus when you go to a range the thing is like about this high and you want to hold that fucking shotgun right here so it's like for me because I'm five seven it'll fucking hit the goddamn thing it'll be I don't know some ranges don't even allow shotguns but we'll definitely take everything else we might do that so that way we can shoot our new uh, AR I think that'd be fun something we can do during the winter but yeah, just another chill day. Oh, I need to get a new humidifier. Like one that's like a bigger one that will fit like 200 square foot. I got one up in my loft, but it's like, eh, I don't know. It's like a little too small. All right, y'all. Let's get ready. And we need to go in town real quick. Yeah, and then we need to find out a way to cover this thing up. Because what I've been doing is just putting a piece of tape on the damn thing and don't really cover it up so we're going to go to a hardware store and see if we can find something that can cover two inches so that way <clears throat> when i'm not using it only using it for the fire it will uh because it brings in a lot of cold air and uh that ain't good so we're going to what the fuck we're gonna uh see what we can do about that maybe they have something i don't know some rubber grommet or something, I don't know. But I'm gonna do some uh, sweeping real quick. Love this little sleeper. This thing hasn't failed on me yet. It's a little wise sweeper. And you got different modes. So that's high, but man, that it dies so quick. It'll die in like 15 minutes. So if you have anything bigger than, a bigger house than 15 minutes sweeper, it'll be pretty fucked up. <laughs> Might just need to put it on medium. We got something. But one thing I was thinking about when getting uh, the humidifier. So, 
you don't ever want to put that next to a air purifier and the reason that is is because it just doesn't it really doesn't work well it thinks it has impurities in the air and the fucking sweeper just fell so it just uh thinks it has impurities in the air because of the moisture content in the air and uh it'll just it'll just make that air purifier just go off like crazy so you gotta you gotta really watch it but i think that air purifier that i have is really really good now that is also from wise i, I need to go get more of those fucking jesus lord i need to go get more of those uh things that i built so i put made this thing for my vr rack it's for a broomstick you just pull it out i need to put those inside of the bathroom so that way i can just put up my uh shit without it being all fucking clicky clacky we need we need to be more organized all right well we're almost ready here so listen to this that's satisfying that's my vr headset all righty well we're about to leave for launch fucking we are going to mars i wish that'd be fucking crazy that'd be a fucking video tony house jack today we are going to mars I always thought it'd be crazy because my house is mobile. Imagine, I don't know, start like uh, SpaceX. He's like, Jack, we can make your tiny house go into uh, to Mars. And like, we have to load my fucking tiny house up in on a fucking space station because it's only 20 foot. So they got the cargo room. I was always thinking, wouldn't that be fucking crazy? Just load my tiny house up on in Mars and then I'm living in living on mars but it's like a fucking dome it'd be fucking crazy dude i'd have automatic million views every fucking every fucking time that would be absolutely insane every video would be insane actually it might be really boring <laughs> just to see the tiny house like that'd be movie type shit what do you guys think do you think we will actually see in our lifetime people going to mars do you think that actually exists it'd be kind of cool to see Alrighty, well, we're off to go do the damn thing for the day. Oh, gotta get my, or no, I left my, yep, pocket knife. Alright, there we go. We are good to go. Sweet. Alright, well, let's go. Alrighty, and we're back. Phoenix is in the building. Just got done uh, getting a massage and then also uh, shipping out those forks from the Sauron. Um... I also just got done doing some emailing, so pretty much got the rest of the day. I wanted to show you this. Got a little flask. Check that out. It's clear. Just something I can put in my pocket so I don't have to carry around a big ass walking water bottle. Might get something a little bit different than that, but it was only a couple bucks, so got it. But uh, I'm going to just chill out for a little bit, and then uh, later on we're going to cut some wood. I ain't got too much going on, really. I just got to... I'm so fucking drained. Oh my God, I'm so fucking tired right now. I'm just exhausted. But there's not much we need to do, really. I got everything ready to fucking rip. So we might answer some questions. I really want to sit down and just uh, go through that ham radio stuff so that way we can get that started. But uh, here in a little bit, I think I might. We're ready. I just need to chop some wood up, get it ready for tonight. We're going to have some stir fry for tonight that sounded sounds fucking delicious so we're gonna do that and i uh, I, I gotta go grab uh, my new fire bricks so let's do that right now actually fire bricks just came in let's go take a look and see what they look like brand new ones i'm not gonna put these in just yet maybe we'll do that i don't know maybe later this week but also i don't want to do them i don't want to do all of them either because all of them are not bad. Just the back ones aren't. So, oh, pull that out. There we go. This is the bricks. I don't even want to take them out, but pretty much you see them. Hey, I'll do one for the thumbnail. Thumbnail! Nice. So them will fit in the back and be pretty good. Save these for later. Firewood stove has been working pretty well, even though it has two cracked bricks. So now at least I got some new ones. So. Speaking of fire bricks, let's go chop some wood, shall we? And all right, Bobby. What are you doing, Bobby? Are you doing okay, Bobby? We're gonna go outside and chop some wood. 
we gotta put some gloves on first so we don't freeze and then oh shit we can get all nice and toasty so let's do do that now let's actually i need to put I need to just grab one bucket really there we go have more room so let's go outside and load up everything let's get the diesel heater filled up generator filled up get the wood filled up that's how we uh prepare for the night because i uh consume a little bit more electricity during the night just because i'm fucking around with my ps5 playstation just all the different stuff that i like to fuck around to wind down all right Did you guys situated right there looks good so we got some big old chunks right here i do want to cut some of these up some of these uh, bigger oak pieces up just cut them in half because uh, they're so big that i don't want to it just helps just a little bit you need a fucking hit her harder than that jack there you go stuff like that oh shit there you go nice little chunks like this that does a lot better than big fucking chunks like this oh that's a fucking hard one right there i left it mark there's one there's two that's a nice solid brick right there and then we go down the middle these right here they just take forever to warm up so i like to cut them in half as much as i can it helps the little mini wood stove even better here soon i'm gonna have to just use these for kindling as well this oak wood they just got so low btus or high it's either low or high i don't know but anyways it just takes a long time to get them all and then for some reason it dies down real quick so that's why i mix the wood with a little bit of this type of wood it helps out but we're gonna chop this bucket up and get her all nice and chopped up as much as possible see i get these weird ass fucking side ones you see that i can cut it up three times that's what we're talking about then we can do a little there you go yep that'd be good just cutting these up as much as i can we don't want to burn now that's fucking spray foam there we go so yeah let's do a thumbnail 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 weather's been just staying around like this the entire time for the last week or so and it's just peeling off the fucking bark on this just bark hitting right now good lord there we go yep we're good on that one let's try to peel this one real quick there we go get some oh look at that that'd be nice oh fucking hell so oh yeah that'd be a good piece for some i should have been doing this all summer long right but when you do this stuff for some reason you just do it during the winter because <laughs> you got so much stuff to do during the summer but we're gonna do the opposite this summer we're gonna focus on cutting a lot of wood up so almost done here yep cut that up a little bit more there we go and there we are we got our wood for tonight i like how everything pretty much stays in a nice little bucket so one bucket is one night that's what i've been finding out so let's go put some gas in the generator this generators generator box is holding on take off the wire pull it out and we are good to go sweet it might be already full because i don't think i needed it last night i don't know we'll see not too sure all right let's see Yep, we didn't use it a lot, so we're good here. We had a lot of sun the last few days, so it's been pretty good. Pull that back, turn it on. We'll start that up when uh, we start cooking. And let's put some diesel fuel in the diesel heater. I put a little footstool by the diesel heater. You guys will see. See, this is nice now. Look, I'm taller, so I can step up and see the. We don't even really need to put any in there, but we'll top it off. Right. It took maybe a couple gulps, and we're done. We are done for the day. So, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. It's been a pretty good week so far. Last week was pretty good. I'm gonna edit this video, eat, 
and then play some uh, poker. I've been getting into poker lately, so. VR poker, real poker, so pretty fun. All right, let's get this wood inside. Get it all nice and toasty for tonight. So yeah, I think that's it for today, guys. I uh, didn't have too much going on, but we got the stuff that we needed to get done done, which is hard to like to see. So now it's time to chill out. I gotta see how much batter we got. Let's see, 41, 38, we're good to go. So we're gonna make some, I got some uh, Texas toast in there. And then uh, I'm gonna warm up some Texas toast and eat some lasagna. And later on, I'm gonna cook some stir fry. So we're good to go, guys. Gonna edit this video for you guys, upload it. This will be Wednesday's video. So it's almost five o'clock now. We're gonna edit this video. And then uh, eat, do some stuff on the computer, get that shit done, play some poker, eat some more, go to bed. But during bed, we're going to be learning about ham radio shit. So that's the goal. All right, y'all. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you got any questions that you guys want me to answer at the end of the videos, like I've told you guys multiple times, leave it in the comments. And then I'll answer them at the end. So until then, I will see you guys in the next video.